So in this short video, I'm going to use Microsoft Designer to new feature called Restyle Image. So here I am going to be able to give Designer an existing file, an existing picture, which I can choose from a various number of places, such as my OneDrive, um, local files, Google Drive, those kind of things. So I'm going to upload a new image. I'm going to select it from my local device. You'll see it will pick some other images up that I've already used, but I'll go to my device. I'm then going to choose a picture, so we're going to find a, uh, an old picture of myself. Click on that and open it. That will essentially upload it into Designer. I can then select that image. Click on select. And now I can choose the style I want. So this will give me a load of predetermined image styles. So I can have a look through these and pick one. I'm going to choose Claymation, which is actually one of my favorite style images. And I can then add some additional elements to a design. So this might be things like, you know, things I want around the image. So just like I would with any other image designer prompt. So I can, so I want to include some laptops and technology, for example. So I can do that, click on Generate. Designer will go away and create me the usual set of four images to choose from. And it's kind of done an okay job of that. Uh, I may want to tweak that so I can go back to where it says elements. I could also tweak the style or change the images. I can upload multiple images if I want to as well, but I'm just gonna go in here and change the element. So I'm gonna say that I'm working on a beach, uh, waves are crashing, listen to music, working on a laptop. So we'll give that a go, click on generate, see what it comes back with. So it thinks for a few moments and there we go. So it's created that image. I look pretty much the same. It has got me working on a beach with my laptop, with my headphones on. So I'm going to choose that image. I could just download it from here. That could be great, but I can also choose to edit and that will now open the full designer editor in which I can create publications or cards or again, further filter the image. So all I'm going to do here is uh, scroll down. I may choose to pick a different uh, style for that image or I can use the tools on the left hand side and add text or add to a template or just add some text. So I'm just gonna add some text very quickly to this. So I'm just gonna say hybrid working, there we go. Hybrid working at its best, I think, if that was the, the approach. I did actually work from a beach the other week, it was quite nice. And once I've done that, of course, designer will pull up with more ideas. So I can now scroll down here and click on a different style. So this one looks quite nice. I think I'll click on that. And there we go. Um, created an image from an existing image and then used that to create a style.